talking and call, and I, just, I constantly hear Kylan freaking out in the background like he's being murdered. Oh god. How's everyone doing? Good! Being a terrible club member. Uh, Silver, yeah. you're the best club member. How about that? Oh. Nah, I'm oh. the worst because, uh... I'm, I'm on episode 12. <laughs> Well, while you're watching episode 12, let's go ahead and introduce all of ourselves. Um, okay, so, hey guys, <laughs> welcome to this week's Anime Analytics, where we'll watch an anime and we'll all talk about it. This is pretty much our anime book club for everyone who's new here. Um, this week's episode is Shingeki no Bahamut, Bahamut, also known as Rage of Bahamut. <laughs> let's see if I mess that up at all. Anyways, I'm your host, Diggy Stock, and I'm the president of the Otaku Anonymous. Yeah. I, I'm Echo and I can't be funny today. Oh. Kira. Oh, um, I'm Kira and I like cats. <clears throat> and I'm Larry. I'm making bags. Yeet. <laughs> I'm Silver and apparently today I am last on the list. Oh, yeah. Oh yeah, Sunny's Sunny. Not here. Oh, and yeah, Sunny is absolutely. Sunny, <clears throat> if anyone, He's if anyone's in wondering, sunny Florida. Yeah, Sunny is missing in action. It's always Sunny where he is. Uh... Good job, Larry. Got okay, him. so, Got him. <laughs> <laughs> so, um, today, oh, let's get right into it. Um, before watching this anime, who who is actually new to watching this anime? Actually, Kira. Me and silver. I Me as well. So, um, Echo and Larry, you guys can answer this question if you remember that far back. Uh, just what were your first thoughts going into this anime? Like, just knowing what it was about, or just seeing the animation and stuff. What did you guys think about it? Echo, would you like to go first? Um. So I saw either the trailer or the poster or something and i was pretty hyped about it and then i found out that it was a gacha game anime and then i was like oh no it's gonna be bad <laughs> and then i saw that first episode and i was like oh no i've never been more glad to be wrong and that that was it really so, I actually didn't know it was a gacha game until you just said it. Oh. I had no idea. Um, I came into this anime, um, not blind. It's because Aang told me about it. He said, hey, watch this anime. It's really good. It feels like a uh, an RPG. And I was like, oh, all right, cool. So then, um, <clears throat> you know, I just, I was like, oh, I got nothing to watch. He was like, oh, I, I should watch that one. There's only 12 episodes. He, I was like, I'll, I'll, I'll just watch an episode. And then watch one episode. And I was like, holy shit, I... And he finished this. And I finished it in one day because it was only 12 episodes. I was like, holy fuck, this anime is so fucking good. And yeah, so my first impression, I literally didn't have any. I just went, oh, Aang said it's good. I should go watch it. And then once I watched it, I couldn't stop. There, was, I didn't. Yeah, I binged it in one day. Shit was good. Okay, I'm done. Silver? Not ready yet? W would 12, 12 episodes? You mean... The first season that mm -hmm. the 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 act because the we were watching the sequel weren't we we were watching genesis not virgin soul well good thing i watched both oh okay yeah we're just talking about the first we're just talking about the first I was, one i was about to lose it so we're <laughs> <laughs> I kind of assumed, like, I, I was looking and I was like, wait a second, this is, this is the, uh, the, the, the two-week one, wasn't it? No. Uh, it was the two-week one, but we only made or it, it was the uh, same, first it was semester. The same slot, yeah. Right, so, in my head, I went, oh, it's the two-week one, so we must be watching Virgin Soul, because it's 24 episodes. And I looked at it and I went... Wait a second, I haven't seen the, the first season, that's only 12 episodes, so I should probably watch that. 
first, which is why I'm on episode 12 of Virgin Soul right now. Well, you should watch Virgin Soul anyway, because, like... Well, yeah, no, it's great. Oh, and, my God, yeah. Uh... Uh, you need to experience uh, Nina and her squishy face. A fucking egg. Virgin soul is something that describes all of you. Oh, oh. oh are you sure? Too, too far. Well, egg. yeah. Well, like, yeah. Kira's actually I mean, married. Yeah, I'm sounds, married. Sounds, sounds good, Diggy. <laughs> okay, thank you, Larry. <laughs> so okay, well, I'm, I'm, I'm glad I watched the... I'm... Do yeah. you not read the club board ever, Silver? I did read the club board. It just says yeah. Shingeki no Bahamut, and this yeah. was the two-week slot, so I assumed I, it was the 24 episode. We should have specified if that's... Yeah, that's because totally Because I fine. thought it was the 24 episode 1-2, so I'm actually on episode 13 of the second one. <laughs> yeah, it's but I did watch fine. the first one first. Yeah, I was so confused. Yeah, Don't worry about it, because we're actually going to do the second one as our two-week, right, Diggy? So, like, it as goes the together. next two-week, yeah. Uh, okay. Oh, all right. So it goes I'll together. I'll watch it because I love it so far. <laughs> <laughs> okay, so never mind, Diggy. Don't use that screenshot I gave you in the in the the thing. I know. I looked from... at it and I was all like, I don't know what that reference is. All right. Ah, <laughs> uh, my bad. <laughs> that was why I said I, I would handle it. the pictures. <laughs> well, no, no, no. I just I came across in the current episode I was watching a. Uh, because I thought this was what we were talking about. I was like, oh, this is a really good screenshot. Send me the screenshot. All right. Send me it too, because I'm on episode 13, so I'll know exactly what you're talking about. <laughs> so, uh, I guess I'll I'll be the one to answer the question next. I mean, Silver, unless you want to answer it right now. I had, well, the, going into it, I had no idea. I looked at Virgin Soul and went, hey, this looks kind of cool. And I went, wait a second, there's a prequel. I should watch that first. <laughs> that's, oh that's, my what, that's, what my, that's what my thought process was of it. Smart move, because you have to watch the first one first. Yeah. yeah. I mean, I'm that's so what happy. we're just talking about too. anyway, so... Oh, yeah. Sorry, guys. Getting <laughs> off track. <laughs> yeah, a little bit. Um... Well, me first going into this anime, uh, it was just Larry kept bugging me for, like, it's like two fucking years of him <laughs> wanting me to see this anime until I forgot what we were doing, but both of us were busy with something, so we just sat down and watched the entire thing. And it was like, oh my, I fucking loved it. But the thing is, I thought it was going to be the ending to an. I, I, I thought this anime was another anime that I don't want to say because in that anime everybody dies. So I was expecting everyone to die in this one. So I was all like, okay. And they're getting me super attached to the characters. Everyone's gonna fucking die, and I know it. And then no one, nothing like that actually happened. <laughs> then I was like, wait, what? I thought I thought everyone died. I heard so many things that everyone just gets fucking murdered in the end. But no, I, I was, I was happily mistaken. Mm. The anime, it, it's I I I want to say it, but because it came out the exact same season as Shingeki no Bahamut. Bah Bahamut. But what do you call it? Um, I don't know if anyone hasn't seen it yet. It was very popular around its time. It was like as popular as Attack on Titan kind of thing. I'm gonna I write mean, it I, down I, in this. I, thing. I would maybe, I would maybe know if you'd said his name. There, it's, it's down the club board. I don't want to spoil it for the rest of the people who might not have seen it yet. Oh, 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 yeah, oh, I mistaken that. it for oh, that anime. Oh, okay. oh, that anime. Oh, that anime was so good. So, wait, no, that everyone doesn't die. In that I mean, anime. Lot, well, that I know people, a lot of people lot do of die. People oh, die. my you God. You can essentially say. 90%. 90%. 90%. 90%. 90%. 90%. 90%. 90%. 90%. 90%. 90%. 90%. 90%. 90%. 90%. 90%. 90%. 90%. 90%. 90%. 90%. 90%. 90%. 90%. 90%. 90%. 90%. 
Wait, you didn't like Grand Blue Fantasy? <laughs> I did. I didn't like Grand Blue Fantasy. I thought it was pretty neat. I I watched it. Four out of ten. Oh man, I thought it was pretty cool. <laughs> uh, so like <clears throat> a thing that you'll see in a lot of gacha anime is like there will be a character that shows up for like thirty seconds of an episode, and they are quite clearly a character that has a character design. Like, they, they aren't just a background character or, like, a filler uh, character. Yeah, I, I get so, you. like, it, it's a lot more standout in Grand Blue Fantasy, where it's, like, the shopkeeper in the background has got, like, 5,000 belts on. Why is there so many things on him? <laughs> Why the bitch wearing so many belts? <laughs> yeah. Uh, it doesn't happen as much in Shingeki no Bahamut. Uh, but it's still a noticeable thing. I see. Mm, next, Kira. Um, what was the question? Uh, how do you feel after watching the anime? Um, I liked it. I enjoyed it. I watched the other season, <laughs> but I saw it the other season was because I was supposed to watch that one. But, because <laughs> like going into it, I had no idea like what to expect. I had no idea what it was about. Didn't know anything about it. So I had no idea. So I didn't have any expectations for the anime, but I am pleasantly surprised. Like I enjoyed it. Thought it was good. Characters were funny as fuck. <laughs> and yeah. <laughs> Larry. You know what this anime made me feel like? It gave me the same feeling I had with Chika. It felt like an RPG. I really liked it that. It was one solo adventure with one single goal in mind. And as the story continued, you find out more and more and more. And you start finding out the truth of what's really happening. And you find that it, it's not just as simple as uh, bringing someone to getting to one place. It, it, there's more to it, you know. And that discovery feels just like an RPG. It feels exactly like a Japanese RPG. And it was executed so well. On top of the animation, on top of the characters, it was it was amazing. And also the setting. The setting was so good. Holy shit. Mm. That's how I feel after watching it, you know. And I like how there was two split parties where, where you knew that they were both good guys. They're not really bad. They're just both people, you know. It, that's what it felt like. I, I loved it so much. That's Silver? Uh, <laughs> like, like what I, I don't know. It was, I didn't know it was based on a gacha game. I really enjoyed it. Like I said, I, same thing as Kira. I <laughs> thought we were supposed to watch the second one. So I was like, oh, I'll just kind of rush through the first one and get the story real quick to get to the second one. But I did enjoy it, and I enjoyed the characters. So... Ah! <laughs> <laughs> I mean... Yeah. I I, I, I will rewatch it. It's not like I'm going to be like, oh, well, forget it. After this, I'm not going <laughs> to go back and figure it out even better now. <laughs> <laughs> it was enjoyable enough to watch again. Mm-hmm. Um, so, uh, after I was done watching it, and no one fucking, like, got fucking murdered, it was great. I loved it. It really reminded me of Final Fantasy IX, which is, like, my favorite video game ever. Uh, that's all I gotta say about it. It really reminded me of Final Fantasy IX. I love the whole fantasy feel to it. It's nice. It's not, like, it wasn't some stupid harem shit. You know, it was, a, yeah. it was a nice, decent romance story with action. It was pretty good. I liked it a lot. Yeah. Uh, moving on to the next question. What was your guys' favorite characters? You want to do favorite parts or favorite characters first? I guess favorite characters. parts, actually. Characters. Oh, oh, okay, never uh, mind. Fuck me. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> Let's do favorite characters. Uh, I like Favaro. He reminds me of Zidane from Final Fantasy IX. That's it. <laughs> 
I, uh, I I probably can't say Favreau because like you all know the only reason that would be for. Um but I kind of can't pick a favorite character. I I love everyone in the first season so consistently. Like even even the bad guys, even uh Azazel in Cerberus. Cerberus is cute. So yeah, I, I do. I think the only one I, 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 the only one I didn't like initially, was, uh, Jan. I thought she was a bit of a Mary Sue that didn't fit with the rest of everyone else. Hmm. I forgot which one that was. Uh, long blonde uh, hair, spear, uh, the saint. Yeah, the one that had the magical oh. powers was human. Oh, okay, yeah. Uh, Joan of Joan Arc, of Arc. Right? Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, well, Jan of Arc, they call her. Well, yeah, yeah well, they call her Jan Dark, but it's yeah. Joan of Arc. Yeah. But her name's Jan. <laughs> her name isn't Joan. <laughs> her name's Jeannie. They yeah. used to call her <laughs> Joanne de Arc. <laughs> oh, God. Oh, God. Joanne Fabrics? <laughs> oh, God. Uh, okay, so, Kira? Okay, my favorite characters either has to be the zombie girl, because I just thought she was adorable and funny, yes, or <laughs> um, Rita. Rita was her name. I couldn't think of it for a second. Or Cerberus. Because, uh, you know me, I love, like, girls with, like, any kind of ears or anything. And she had a little puppet that would talk, and she would go, Ruff! And I thought it was so cute! I thought it was so cute! Are those puppets alive? Do you think I those think... puppets are alive? I don't know, because she said she sent them out to go find them. And then she also talks with them. But then sometimes she doesn't have her hands in them, and they still talk. She's a demon. She can make them talk without putting her hands in it, okay? So... <laughs> So those I mean, two are my favorite characters out of season one. At least season one, they're my favorite characters. Okay, yeah. <laughs> Larry? Larry? He's dead. Silver, go ahead. Oh shit, was I muted? Uh, yeah. Oh. Uh, I really like Kaiser. I'm really into like the chivalry knights and shit. And, like, I actually did not like Favreau all the way to the very end. He was, like, I'm not saying, like, oh, God, I got hate Favreau shit, but, like, he, he was, like, he was the kind of character that I didn't like because he was, like, the dishonest liar and shit, but he made the story so interesting because of his character, which was great. Like, you can't have this without without a character like him. But, um, I, like, if I had to choose between Favreau or Kaiser, I, I like Kaiser. Cause he's the main character too, and he, he was fucking funny. Mm. He was cool. Chivalry knights, manly shit. I like it. <laughs> <laughs> I uh, I, I'm kind of with Echo, where all the characters were pretty good. I uh, I don't like the duck. The <laughs> duck. <laughs> Just eat him. I mean, I know I know he's like a god or whatever, but I just he's annoying. Um, but then I especially agree with Kira about Rita and Cerberus. Yes. Like Rita, Rita, best girl. Little zombie zombie doctor girl, best girl. Oh yeah. Cerberus is super cute with the puppets. And they're probably alive. I mean, she's named Cerberus, the three-headed dog that's the guardian of hell, yeah. so they're probably alive? I'm assuming they're alive. I don't know. They're demon They're demon puppets. I mean, why wouldn't they be alive? Exactly. Come on. <laughs> you know, I but really yeah, that's like... Oh, yeah, super yeah. cute. I, I really oh, like how everyone had a partner in this, uh, in this anime. Oh, yeah. That was pretty mm. neat. I always yeah, liked that everyone anime. paired off everyone's paired off and then like the story constantly intertwines with them and then sometimes you'll see what they're doing you see what they're doing like the second episode where they get the zombie girl that shit was cool i was like yo this direction is fucking amazing 
Like, oh no, the, the bit that was really cool with the pairing off was when Kaiser and Amira got kidnapped by the giant squid. Oh yeah, that was... And then oh, was Favaro yeah. and Rita as a pair, like, that was good. <laughs> Like that's some video game bullshit right there. Like, and then at the and yeah. then at the end they they gang up all together. It's like, yo, that's that's exactly what I'm talking about right there. Uh, yeah. Mark says I loved everyone in the whole show except the king. He was trash. Totally agree. Totally. Agree. My favorite would have to be Amira. I loved how she was really a child at heart, but was a cool half demon, half angel. She was adorable at times and also intimidating. I felt really bad for her when she met her mum. That hit me with the feels. Also, I like that she has a big appetite for food. Food is life. Mm. Roast duck that. breast is pretty good silver. <laughs> <clears throat> duck is pretty good. It's expensive oh, yeah. too. Did you all it. watch it Japanese dubbed? Yes. I watched in Japanese. Yeah. Was so I watched it there is an English dub of it. I watched the Japanese dub initially, uh, the first time I watched it, and then I tried to watch the English dub this time. I got two episodes in and I had to stop because of Kaiser's voice. Oh, no. <laughs> I think that's Kaiser's... how it is mostly. Like, when you go for it, like, if you watch in Japanese and then try to watch it in English, it's always kind of bad. Like, at least for me, that's how I, it usually is. I, I don't really feel that. I feel like I can appreciate the an English dub more if I've watched the Japanese dub previously. Mm -hmm. But Kaiser's voice actor kind of does that thing where he shouts without shouting. I don't even bother with the English dubs unless somebody I trust says the English dub is decent. Someone you trust like, told you to watch Line Barrels, so I think you should stop trusting people. <laughs> <laughs> that is true. Well, I was going to say, like, if Echo said the English dub of, of whatever is okay, I'd trust Echo and be like, all right, well, stop trusting if, I, people. <laughs> if, I, if I feel like it, I'll check out the English dub, but I, I watch... I watch everything subtitled because almost anything in English dub, I've never felt like the English voice actors get the, they never seem to get the nuances of the scenes, right? Mm. Like Echo said, most of the time they do the yelling without yelling thing. Like I think I was emphasize spoiled by of... Dragon Ball English dub in that regard, because they're actually screaming their heads off in, in the English <laughs> dub. Of that I actually... I think there's only one anime that I've ever loved English for, and it was for Inuyasha. And that's the only English dub I've ever actually enjoyed. Except Kagome's voice. She's, she's a little annoying. Her voice. I liked a lot of English dubs, but it's usually the older stuff, like uh, Yu Hakusho or yeah. Gooden Login. <laughs> I've never watched the English. God damn it, Diggy. <laughs> Reset the counter. So, Reset, yeah. Reset the um, counter. I think it's all like oldies like everything <coughs> below 2000 and like just within that 2000 range is like perfect and now english dub is like whatevs yeah like it, cowboy it's, bebop's it's, english it's dub a, is good yeah it's a hit and miss don't, trigon line barrels don't watch it that's what batosai said that's funny it's too late dude we already watched it yeah we already <laughs> watched it and it's, dead. Dead. it's fucked for us we're all zombie <laughs> <laughs> uh, we're we're all we're all zombie doctors, no. <laughs> it's you not Daijo that? it's not Daijobu anymore, yo. <laughs> I really like the English dub to Roni Kenshin. Dude, Roni Kenshin was fucking good. Yeah, all the older stuff. I don't think I could ever watch it in Japanese because that English dub was so good to be honest. That's how I feel. Well Kenshin is voice acted by a They're... woman in Japanese. They're both good. They're both really good. Mm. Kenshin doesn't sound as tough. He sounds like a like a frail he's, he's... little man. That actually mm. makes his character a better, I think. Where he doesn't sound tough, but then when he fights, it's just... No, but oh. like a boy can sound sweet, you know? But like they yeah. straight up made him a woman. And then when he finally goes into Potosai mode, it's just like... Ugh, I didn't like it. Yeah, but I like the English a lot better. And, oh, I also yeah. like, um... I know in Samurai X they didn't use the same voice actor. Which was You nice. want a man, not a woman. 
Well, we're, we're, talk, we're talking about that. Shingeki no Bahamut right now. Uh, yeah. yeah you're right, you're right, you're okay, right. so how hard does that opening go? Because that that opening <laughs> theme... That opening was fucking so... Yeah. That opening that was, was so hard to get. I was trying to like download it for the longest time. You could not get it until like a year after the anime came out. Same. So or you could get it, but it was only like the minute 20 second version. It was the anime yeah. opening. Yeah. Yeah. Short ver. <clears throat> All right, Mark, your your bag is your bag is done, Mark. Oh, was there anything else in chat that it, anyone else wrote? Opinions on the uh, No, no, just listing English dubs. That opening theme was hardcore. Yes. And Echo sounds sweet. Maybe he sounds like an Echo. Oh. Uh... Oh, next question. <laughs> what was your guys' favorite scene? Echo, please feel free to start with your sweet echoey voice. Oh. oh. <laughs> you flatter me. Um, <laughs> my favorite scene is probably the scene where Amira gets drunk. <laughs> right? Right? That was the best. I did not where expect that. She, like, she just like takes the sip and she like bursts a little bit and then she starts dancing and it's just so good it was so well animated as well <clears throat> and that scene made it kind of obvious that they did the they do the thing where you animate over a video of a person mm. rotoscoping yeah, rotoscoping. I forgot the name of it. I knew it was R word. Never heard of these terms, but all right, cool. I I can already assume what it is. But yeah, the dancing gif right there. Holy shit, it's fucking yeah. beautiful. Yeah. Yeah. Ooh, that shit, that scene was like, oh my god, I am mesmerized. I cannot take my eyes off of that. Mhm. Mm like Yuri on ice, almost. It's like that guy when he touched his ass. Yeah, I was like, Yuri Yo. on ice did the same thing. They rotoscoped the the skating mm. and stuff in that. Uh, Kira. My favorite scene has to be when she's like in the castle and the castle is being attacked, and she's like, uh, Amara is <laughs> in the kitchen. She's just stuffing her face, and she, they're like trying to pull <laughs> her off the table. She's like, No, I want to eat. But they're like, You're free. You're gonna get captured. I want to eat. I relate to that so much because food is life. <laughs> <laughs> it happiness so it's like that was my favorite scene because i thought it was so funny i was literally dying laughing when i saw that <laughs> that scene so that has to be one of my favorite scenes uh larry um I, I, uh, fuck, uh, um i probably have to agree with echo with the dancing scene that shit was mesmerizing because of um, because of all the bag making and shit, I was only able to get to, up to episode six. So I felt like there was another scene I liked it. I think you know what? Seeing these gif images, there's one I really liked it. It's when Joan of Arc turned to a fucking demon and just killed oh. her. Fucking, I was <laughs> like, yo, when I saw that, and then the end of the episode, I was like, yo, did that just happen? Did it actually just happen? How are they gonna recover from this? And then they did. And I'm like, oh man, this is good. That scene was like. That scene flipped the script for me. I didn't expect that shit. I was like, oh, she gets burned out of the stake, right? Like, that's what happens, right? And then, like, she did. And then she turned to a fucking... I was like, oh, the story's getting taken a turn. I was sad, though, when that happened. I was like, no! Don't do it! I was like, that's a, that's a good twist right there. I was feeling that part. Uh, Silver. Anytime one of those anytime there was a beautifully animated hardcore goddamn dragon on screen <laughs> dragon <Dar. laughs> they oh so good they looked so good <laughs> none, none of the other scenes the, the just the dragon <laughs> just yep the rest of it was cool but the dragon I think um, uh, Silver likes dragons. Oh, I love mm. dragons. Dragons are fucking cool. My and the dragon. Scene. Oh yeah, go ahead. So good. 
I was just the dragon looked so good, like they animated it and the way it was drawn, it it, it was amazing. Where <clears throat> a lot of times dragons in anime look like crap, mm. <laughs> or they look like they they're just they, badly animated. They, they look like Yu Gi Oh or a uh, Bakugan. Yeah, like you like if it if it's still, it's like oh hey, it's still and it looks cool, but then it animates and it's like it moves weird. It's like oh, it doesn't feel like a dragon. Eh. This was animated great. Oh, mm. I mean, it's about dragon, so the dragon better be good. I got a question, um, Diggy. Uh, after oh. you do yours, I got a good question. Uh, my favorite scene was when it was. I think it was like one of the very last scenes where he goes to her and he says, "Do I look like a liar?" Like this look like the eyes of a liar, and then she kisses him. Oh yeah! Uh, <laughs> oh, my oh, fucking oh, heart. Yeah. That was that was that was a cute scene. That was. Because like they they played that joke twice. They only played it twice, and at the end they, they played it again. They, and then the third time they did it, it's oh. Good scene. You look so yeah, sincere that my, time. The other two times he was joking heart. around. Yeah. Because I I thought I thought I was like, is it is this really a time for jokes? <laughs> and then oh. It is a time for jokes. Uh, Mark said, <clears throat> my favorite scene would have to be the last battle between Favreau and Kaiser. I thought the fight scene was the best one of the whole season. I love the animation and how they used the bounty wrist thing against oh, that guy. I know. I didn't see that coming and it was such a great plan and paid paid homage to the beginning. Right, mm. like I like how they like, yeah, yeah, like like they played that shit out like, oh shit, like this shit exists. You could do this. Anyone could thought of it, and they thought of it, and we're like, "What are they planning? What are they planning?" Uh, <laughs> what Favreau was to just be like, "All right, I'm down for this plan for you to cut off my arm to do <laughs> I this." Know. Well, he said he wasn't supposed to cut off his hand or some shit, but he was like, "I didn't think, I didn't think it was gonna be that bad." He was <laughs> like, "Eh," and uh, he was like, "Eh, eh it's cool, man. Yeah, what did you do?" Right. Um, oh, go ahead, Larry. So I have a question. <clears throat> oh, wait, we are done, right? Yes. I believe so. so. Something really important when it comes to animes like these. How do you feel about the character design and who has the best outfit? Who's rocking it? Oh, Kaiser. <laughs> Fucking Pompadour. Kaiser? You say Kaiser? Did you? <laughs> <laughs> the fucking Pompadour is amazing, and he has those Death the Kid stripes on him too. It's like shit. Uh, so oh, he does. Those are barrettes. He does. Yeah, I know. He yeah, they're barrettes, but they're still stripes. <laughs> like quick, quick, quick question. Awesome. Um, so silver. Uh, do you like green? The color green? Yes. It's okay. It's not what's one of my favorite? favorites. What's, what's your favorite? I like uh dark oh blues God. and purples. Okay. Why? Ah, uh, fuck! I don't need purple. Oh, well, you got a dark green, a dark magenta, and a black string. Okay. <laughs> Sorry, I'm making bags right now. Magenta? I mean, if you gave me options instead of just asking what my favorite was, I could have told you out of what you had. Okay. I've already but, made two. Is that's this why. really the time for this? I know. Uh, yeah, right. I know. <laughs> Sorry. I, I just, thought that was gonna. I thought that was gonna lead into something. I this the, is gonna uh, the, the character yeah. designs. Well, okay, yeah. Adam. Okay, you told me your color. So, uh, do you like the zombie girl then? Because she she matches your color. That's that's a good color. <laughs> yes. Nice segue, Larry. <laughs> there you uh, go. It, it, it all falls in. Yeah. The okay zombie girl. Yeah best design rita best girl from a purely design standpoint i love lucifer and azazel hmm. i love i love their like that they were quite clearly angelic in design at some point where hmm. all the proper demons have got bat wings and scales but they still have feathered wings. Because they're well, fallen angels. Yeah. Oh. Yeah. 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 My god. I mean, that, that makes sense. Anyway. That makes sense, I know. I'm surprised you don't like Rita more. The, you know, the little zombie goth thought, Echo. Would you oh, have not goth. With um, the umbrella um, and her little hat? Come on, her little do, hat. Do, 
uh, Amira's design from that episode where they go shopping and she has like the kind of gothic Lolita dress on in one of the yeah. things. I tried to get a picture of that and I couldn't find one and I didn't want to go back and take a screenshot myself. My favorite... Kaiser was pretty fucking good, but I just... Oh my god, Arima? Kaiser's was... leggings though. <laughs> why does he? Why is his trousers skin colored, and why is he wearing a cod piece over it so it just looks like he's walking around in a speedo and knee high boots? Maybe he is why, walking around in a speedo and knee high boots. I mean, that's why fine. does he have to do that? <laughs> to maybe. me, every time he like falls and his legs are open, it's like, man, come on. Maybe he is wearing a speedo and knee high boots. I mean, you're not far enough in season two to be sure that he, for you to see the. Uh, the, the proof that he is wearing trousers that are just skin colored. Fair enough. Next. 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 Uh, Kita. Uh, I really liked all their designs for the most part. I think it fit their characters really well. They're all their designs, but <clears throat> there was. Amuro, her when her hair was like up in two pigtails with the braid over it, I just loved that. Like, I thought that was so cute, so I'd have to pick that one only because I just love her hairstyle so much. Like, bish, show me how to do that. Like, <laughs> I don't think my hair is long enough. But, I thought that was like, that was my favorite, I guess, outfit, I would say. Because, just because of her hair. That was, that was my favorite. I thought, I thought it was so cute. And it fit, her, it fit her so perfectly when she was, like, acting like a child-ish person. Mm. So, that's why I had so, to... I'm not too familiar with the game. Uh, my only real experience with the universe is the anime. But I'm led to believe that Favaro and Kaiser are only in the anime. They're not in the game. And the, the other outfits that Amira wears are like event outfits from oh. the game. Oh. oh. Max. Oh, Larry? Um, Arima was my favorite. She, for design. In general, the whole design of this whole anime, what I love was that nothing was fucking useless. Like, the outfit was, it seemed like the outfit was made in consideration of actually the setting of it and it actually being a fucking useful thing. Not like uh, a shit ton of buckles for no fucking reason, you know? Mm. Like the outfit looked, uh, you know, like like Kaiser's wearing <laughs> fucking like a, a armored practical. underwear. But yeah, he's practical. He's wearing armored underwear because bitch got to move his legs, man. Like, you know. So you know, the, those, those strappy things across Kaiser's front aren't <laughs> useless? They're not there just for design to look nice. No, I think. But if he needs a a strap, he he was a knight. He was a knight. That's why I think you know because he he was a nobility. Uh, The strappy things at the front are holding his cape on. Yep. All all like fifteen of them. There's two. There's two. No, I'm talking about the green ones that go across his chest, not attached to the cape. There's actually like six. That's there's like of six of them coat. that go. Okay, there's a no, difference between just, wearing it, six it's a belt buckles. Stripy waistcoat. There's a nah. there's a difference between wearing a shit ton of like like uh, belt buckles and like. Well, and yeah, then, yeah. And then you know it's just some straps for your fucking jacket. But then my favorite was Arima because that's her name, right? Amira. Amira. Amira sorry, uh, it's because her fucking demon transformation was just fucking amazing. Oh, I know. She also looks like female Robin, which is a plus. From Fire Emblem. I thought what you meant. Was <clears throat> but uh, it, her, her, de- her demon transformation got me. I was like, yo. I, I don't get your Fire Emblem references. Oh, that's fine. I do, and that's all that matters. It's someone with white hair. Uh, <laughs> Mark says, I love the character designs of everyone in this anime, but I've had to go... I, uh, I'd have to go with Amira's design, both her human form and demon form. Her casual outfit I thought was amazing. I also kind of wish Lucifer played a bigger part in the anime. I liked how he looked demonic, but also glowed. Mm. Yeah. I wish I would have seen Lucifer more. He looks like a metal... He he looks like a... 
He's in a boy band. That's what he is. He's in a dark metal yeah. J-pop boy band. And I love that they have like colored lipstick on as well. Azazel's <laughs> got like the green lipstick in. Uh, Lucifer's got like red lipstick or pink lipstick. Oh. <clears throat> I'm sorry, chat distracted Silver? me for a little bit. Silver? <laughs> what? I talked about... Silver answered. Oh, yeah. With this, the tiny hat. Tiny hat. Hey. 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 You're right, you're right. All right. Um, if you guys were in the same world, what side would you take? Would you would you be in the, in the human realm? Would you want to be a demon? Would you want to be goddess? Um, gods? All humans in this anime fucking suck. <laughs> I would not want to be on the human side, but the gods aren't necessarily that great either. I think I'd want to yeah. be on the realms with demons. I agree with the. I, don't I sound would too think bad I would go to yeah. I think I would yeah. Go looking the looking side. at the story, like it looks I feel like, like the demons have who, more fun. Honestly, I think I think <laughs> the one who fucked up the most were the angels. Like yeah, that's usually the case in stories where there's angels, demons, and humans. The angels mm. are usually the ones that are like, "Well, we're angels. We're on God's side. We're righteous." So, oh, the you thing right. is, yeah. there's, there's angels, but there's no God. Well, there's God. Notice, notice that, like, God. well, yeah. the the angels are gods. Yeah. Well, yeah, but then there's also go other gods. Yeah, but then that's weird because then there's like Lucifer. Well, actually, one of the main gods didn't he die for sealing? Or one of the not the the duck is a god. I'm, I'm I'm meaning like <laughs> in in universe, the angels are just called gods. Like yeah. that that's what you call that race. <coughs> oh yeah yeah yeah. So the like, there is no actual deity. There's just this race of what is angels. But uh, I I want to say demons. <coughs> But knowing other things, I'd probably say the the humans. No, you can't. You can't. You can't take into account. I I I can't. I can't not take it into account. <laughs> oh God! Stop texting me. I well, echo. Yeah. Sorry. Good job. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. It's, it's as human. a as You're a young only Christian the... girl. I'd be on the demon side. <laughs> I'd just That's be on okay the demon with side. me. Hail Satan. <laughs> <laughs> Hail Satan. Hail Satan. Clip that and send it to the church. Don't. Please don't. <laughs> Wait. <laughs> six, six, six. Yeah, just... that's my number. <laughs> I'd get in to make coffee in the morning and they'd be like, you gotta go. <laughs> <laughs> we can't You're have saying silver? coffee. Oh, um, I was just gonna ask Echo, like, literally using the information that you only get from what we were supposed to watch. Well, I, I did say I would pick the demons, but knowing things I know, I would have to say humans. I gave you the answer. Oh, Alright, I got just distracted. No, I got... Uh, you, yeah, I listen to you all the time. I got distracted. <laughs> Uh, can oh, I be a zombie? Just... Yeah. yeah. Why not? Why not? It's like a human race, though. That well, was actually, no, I guess it could that's, be anything that's actually my next question. Okay, you just have to choose a side. Human realm, demon realm, angels. That's actually my next question. You can be the zombie. I was like, can I just be a zombie and help out the my my friends? Whether they're human, demon, or angel? <laughs> okay, Ike. Uh, Mark says, I would like to be in the realm of Amira, half demon, half angel. You need light and darkness to balance it out. They both really messed up, and the king screwed over my opinion of humans. Yeah, I always oh, forget yeah. about the king. Yeah, fuck the king. He wasn't he was important, that's why. It, yeah, <laughs> it was such a, like... He was an asshole, that's why. Yeah. yeah. I don't want to remember him. The only, the only time he is there is when he's fucking things up. Crying to his mom on a painting. <laughs> Alright, um, well, my next question. Oh, wait. Yeah, no, go ahead, go ahead. I was gonna ask. 
<clears throat> so my next question was actually, all right, so obviously this game's not a game. This fucking anime is like an RPG. What's your class? We asked this question probably a million times, but I'll answer it. Um, Paladin. Tank Paladin. Paladin. Diggy's always the tank. I'm a I'm a pugilist. What the fuck is that? The DPS. Punchy. Pun pun punchy McFucker shit. So the monk. <laughs> yeah. The well, I, I would be a monk, but I'm an atheist, so I don't think I'm allowed. Buddy. <laughs> yeah. Um. I don't know. I'd probably be someone that either heals people. Or white mage range damage, yeah, pretty much a mage. Like, I white mage. I prefer. Well, uh, I guess I don't know. <laughs> so it's either one that would like does range damage or heals people. So one or the other. I think it'll or be both. a bard. I think it'll be a bard. I feel like I would like like I would want to play an assassin, but I'd be like, ooh, I just want to be loud and obnoxious and take all the attention <laughs> and just play a bard. Damn it, Larry. What is that what you're gonna say? A zombie bard? I was literally gonna say either some sort of assassin or some sort of bard. So I can either be <laughs> silent and stabby or loud and annoying. Because I like both of those things. <laughs> and you said the same exact thing. Well, it's funny because like I want to be an assassin every time I play games. Like, you know, I want to play assassin, but I'm never good at it. But what you know what I'm good at? Supporting. And I fucking hate it, even though I'm really good at I it. Know. I know. I, I feel your pain. I feel like, you know what I do? I'm like, these bitches would not be alive without me supporting He's funny. them. So like, you know what? The only reason why you did so good is because I kept your ass alive, or else you'd be worthless. You'd be dead. So it's all I mean, safe to me that you carried. That's what I think. If we're gonna go on like what we're actually good at in playing games, and definitely oh, I will be oh dexterity and strength. That's all definitely I mean. a stealthy no assassin. <laughs> yeah, the same. Definitely stealthy assassin, uh, or just a just a tank. Just hey. Everything attack me. I'm gonna just punch you in the face. Keep me alive, please. I got okay. you. <laughs> like, you say... the, those are the two things that I'm the best at. Like, did you say she would be a paladin? But she's not. She's just fucking guts. <laughs> <laughs> I never, I never put on defense. Ever. I, it's all, I, it's I, no yeah, armor or anything. Seen. As fast as I can be and as much strength <clears throat> I can punch. That's all I need. Yeah, Diggy's not a paladin. She's That's fucking guts. guts. That's not even nuts, course. then. Oh my god, that was Guaylo that texted me there. That's just He-Man. The he walks around with a giant sword and no, and like, naked. That, that's just He-Man at that point. I can totally <laughs> see amazing. Diggy wearing the Berserker armor. Yeah, but Diggy doesn't want armor. He wants to be fast. The, the dog ears. He's fast with the Berserk armor. Guts? Well, yeah, I yeah, know, the but... Berserk, you, the Berserk, but Berserk armor is, like, is, a, is an offensive buff. It doesn't do anything defensively. Actually, yeah, actually, it, it, it does the opposite. Gun. It does if the anything, opposite. Yeah, it hurts you. Yeah, hurts that's you. true. That's true. The Berserk Armor is worse. <laughs> I need to read that new chapter, so I'm gonna, I'm gonna, you know, yeah. The okay, Berserk but, Armor is worse. But are you, are you guys ready for the question of the century, though? Oh God. No, no, I'm not. I'm ready. Uh, wait, what, yeah. wait, did you said, read Mark? Mark said he would, uh, he likes doing ranged attack. Uh, ranged attacks with damage, uh, with magic, so it'd be a mage, maybe a summoner. Summoners are pretty fun to play, or be in general. That's pretty cool. All right, you guys ready for the for the question of the century? I don't know I if anyone, so. I don't know if anyone knows it factually. I feel like someone already does know it factually. Wait, one sec, That's... real quick, Diggy. You know that like there's like three, there's like two yeah, gifts and one picture from season two and. This slideshow? Yeah. Okay. I was just going to point that out. <laughs> Don't point out which one. I'm not going to point out what one, but... Because I noticed one of the GIFs has showed up like three times, and I was like, what's that season one? What's that season one? And I've been like fact-checking it. And it's not. <laughs> <laughs> well, I, I just noticed uh, one of the pictures, and I was like, wait a second. I just saw that. 
selling snake oil. <laughs> you guys ready for the question of the century, though? No. Is no, it... you'll have to wait. Okay, you're right. <laughs> is it... All right, guys. Is it Paladin or is it Paladin? Oh, I'm gonna... If you say Paladin genuinely, I'm banning you from life. <laughs> with, with my actual I'm always hammer. a paladin. It's paladin. It's, it's paladin, right? Yeah. Paladin. I'm hey, sorry, what paladin? was the question? <laughs> paladin or paladin? <laughs> Larry, I fucking hate you. It's paladin. Okay, it's paladin. I say. I think I. I used to, say, used to say paladin. paladin. And then Diggy was like, no, it's Paladin. And Angle's like, it's Paladin. And I'm like, fuck. So I started saying Paladin. I just want to make sure if there's anyone else yeah. like me. No. I'm just... nope. No and one I... No one else is like you. <laughs> I'm, I think, I, I think I'm sorry, says, Larry. I think Kin says Paladin or Paladin. I guess, look, look, Kin says Paladin. I guess I'm not the only one. That wasn't Kin, that was Viper. No. It's Paladin. Oh, it, was Vi it was Viper that says it? No, 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 that's, that's, Larry. that's, that's it. Larry just says things weird, though. Larry, say the number one. One? Say I won the game. I won the game? I fucking hate you. <laughs> you heard it, right? You, saying, you heard it? Did you hear why it? Are you, <laughs> why did you... It's it's the same... You, you pronounce it the same way, Larry. The number one and won the game are pronounced the same way. Then why do we do that way? <laughs> they're not spelled the same, but they're pronounced the same. There are lots of words like that, Larry. <laughs> yeah. He says Chef Boyardee to me the other day. I'm oh pretty sure. Oh my god. Oh, <laughs> I gotta go. I gotta go by. <laughs> Chef Why Boyardee. Why are you gonna do that to me like that? Why are you gotta hit because... me with that Chef Boyardee? Anyways, uh, any final That's not thoughts? even an accent. That's not even an accent. It's like, not an water. accent. It's not. <laughs> Like, water is a cool accent. I'm gonna actually kill you. <laughs> Chef, Chef Boyardi? Chef Boyardi is not an accident. It, 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 oh, God. I, I, uh, I gotta go. You, you're like cringe when you say Chef Boyardi. <laughs> any, any final thoughts coming to the anime? Uh, before we go into actually just overall final thoughts and ratings. Anything you guys want to add? Anime was amazing. Yeah. It I enjoyed it. I enjoyed it a lot. I I binged this shit, and then I forced Diggy to watch it, and I was like, "Fuck yas, you watching it, bitch." Us. Uh, uh, all right. Let's go into final thoughts and ratings. Um, my final thought of this is. Uh, oh God, I couldn't conjugate my thoughts into words properly. Uh. <laughs> I like it a lot. I feel like everyone else is going to express a lot more why they liked it. For me, the sole purpose of liking as much as I did was because it reminded me so much of Final Fantasy IX. And it, it, it was it was very well directed. The animation is incredible. I was not expecting it to look so amazing. But um, it's also funny when it needs to be funny. Like I said before, very well directed. And uh, if if you hate dragons, probably not the best thing to watch. If you want to join the... Satan's dark side in the end, you should watch it. Um, Bahamut, Bahamut's uh, a dragon, right? Uh, I, yes, watch yeah. for, a dragon. I, I would watch this again just for Favreau because he's he's my favorite. I like him so much. He's a, he's a good main character. He's Who so animated cool. this? Uh, production IG. Is I that? I give it... I, I'm going to go ahead and give it a 10 out of 10, actually. I liked it a lot. I'm really happy there's a second season. Gonna watch and there's going to be a third season. Yes. What? It's confirmed? Is greenlit it? Uh, it was greenlit before Virgin Soul was actually greenlit and it got delayed. Oh, oh hello. They're mad, mad, ma, ma something in Friends. Ma something Friends. One oh, sec, let me, good. let me, let me find the actual name of it. It is... Minaria. Minaria Friends, Friends. yeah. Uh, interesting. Is that going to be a third season or is that going to be a side story? It's... From what I know, it is more related to the story of the game. Uh, so, like, I think it's going to tell the story of a part of the game. 
It is an Gakuin. adaptation of a popular event, the Minaria Maho Gakuin. Yeah. Within the Shingeki no Bahamut social game. So, yes. something Academy. So, yeah, it's going to be a side story. Well, no, it's... Like, it's going to be main story. If, if uh, anything, Genesis and Virgin Solar side story, because the main story is the game. Echo, what do you rate the anime? We're getting into semantics. Oh. I give it a 10 out of 10. Because I like things. I... I I had wa I had only watched like two or three gacha anime before that, and they had all been kind of bad because like they they want to put budget into their game instead of budget into their anime show, so usually they come out very cheap, and mm. kind of badly written because gacha games don't tend to have a story, so if it's a straight adaptation, it doesn't really have much to go on. Oh yeah, um, I feel you. But the animation in this was amazing. It came out in a season where I don't really remember much else that came out. So like, it just stomped all of the competition. Oh! And it was great in everything that I could measure it in. 10 out of 10. Rakira. Um... I enjoyed this anime a lot. I thought it was really funny, really cute, really serious. Um, I thought the animation was beautiful. The storyline was actually really good, entertaining. Um, I give this an 8 out of 10. I enjoyed it for the most part. But there were like some things like that I, that I guess I couldn't get 100% into but overall it was still really enjoyable and I would definitely recommend it to anyone and everyone so I give it an 8 out of 10 mm. Larry this anime deserves a 10 out of 10 uh, surprisingly I didn't even know it was a fucking gacha game who would have known it was a gacha game what I don't even know what kind of fucking gacha game it is it he doesn't even know how to spell gotcha. It's, Who would have known? Uh, from, oh. from what I've seen, it's kind of similar to Hearthstone. Huh. Yeah, it's oh. some sort of cards. Yeah, look into that, that later. Go on yeah. there. But, um, oh god, this, this anime was just top tier, like... I got hooked on, like, episode one, I was like, yo, I gotta, I gotta see what's up. The animation was amazing, thank god, like... I, and I, I see ex exactly what Echo means by like they don't put work into their actual gacha game because uh, I've watched Grand Blue and while the art was amazing and the characters were like oh these characters are so cool like there was no story there was no story in Grand Blue yeah. and this story was like enticing it was it was like I I need to know and as an event it played like I said it played out like a like an RPG video game where there's questions that's not like where there's a mission. But there's unanswered questions, and as you go through the game, the answers, the questions get answered. But there's more questions to be to be to be answered as well. So then because the because there's a universe at large. Exactly, because there's something that exist there's a, outside the anime. yeah. There's a so... thing happening. There's yeah. There's just things happening around the the whole universe. God so, of games. And it was just it was just fucking executed beautifully. Ten out of ten. Ten out of ten. 11 out of 10. 11. <laughs> 11 out of 10. Right, I'll, I'll make it an 11 for the average. <laughs> Five. 10 pompadours. Uh, oh, yeah. Okay. 10 pompadours. Yes. I agree. <laughs> this, it was awesome. It was animated beautifully. Dragon. Dragon. Mm, dragon. Um, the story was good. Uh, I also, I, I give it a 10 cause it, I'd watch it again. I'd recommend it to people. I'm going to recommend it to people. I'm going to tell people to watch it and I'm going to tell people to watch the sequel. Although before they watch the sequel, they should watch the two short episodes that were released 
uh, in before season two came out, and it's it's just guys being dudes of Favreau and Kaiser, just it's guys just, being dudes, just two bros sitting in a hot tub. Nice. Feet apart. Five feet apart, cause they were five feet apart. <laughs> um, unfortunately, I got the, that reference. Unfortunately, <laughs> yeah, uh, I don't think they are hosted in on anywhere like Crunchyroll. So you will have to find some other method to watch those two episodes. The kind that might not be legal in some countries. Yeah, like coming to my house and sitting on my floor and watching them in my room. Will do. Legal? Be right there. Like an I, it's, it's, it's sitting it's on legal. his floor is illegal. It's legal, cause... but it's not official. Hmm. You're not, you're not supporting his... the franchise by sitting in my room floor. Sitting on his floor is illegal because it's Scotland and you're not allowed to sit on floors in Scotland. You have you know to at least Oregon? have a foot still. Arrest foot still. me now. Do you know in Oregon it's illegal to harpoon a whale from your car? <laughs> <laughs> I'm not even joking. <laughs> Uh, Mark says I have to give this anime a 9.5 out of 10 it's such a great anime I loved all of the characters the character designs the story and the soundtrack was beautiful yeah the soundtrack was really good uh, and the fight scenes were excellent the animation was so good especially the 3D animation with the dragons that was so good yeah, they didn't I love the unique the setting as well mm-hmm. I highly recommend this anime watch it right now if you haven't seen it yeah I On 12 episodes. do believe, as of right now, this anime is now the highest rated on Otaku's Anonymous. Yo. Ah, uh, yeah. With a 9.75 out of 10. Pretty sure the lowest Ooh. is, um... Uh, the line lowest barrels. will be Line, line Barrels. Yeah, Line Barrels had like a 2. It was like a 2.5. <laughs> Five or something. Yeah, it was like a two or a two and a half. Because, because it was going to have like a four and I give it a zero. Then <laughs> just dragged it down. <laughs> yeah. But this gets a 9.75 out of out of 10. Love it. Good and Lagan is probably going to get like a hundred out of a, out of a 10. So. <laughs> Good and Lagan just gets a spiral out of we 10. We can never talk about that one. <laughs> we can never review that We're one. We're just going to never <laughs> do an episode. <laughs> Because if we review Gurren Lagann and anybody doesn't give it a 10, everyone else is going to stop talking to that person. Gurren yeah, Lagann like has to be yeah. like for the life. final episode. Like there has to <laughs> no. be like a meteor for coming Earth. for Earth. And it's like, <laughs> this is the last episode of Attack is Anonymous. We're finally yeah. going to do it. Gurren Lagann. <laughs> <laughs> for 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 April's full, we're gonna do good and lagging, but we're gonna do the music video special, and we're gonna ha- talk for like two hours about the music video. <laughs> oh, about the stars music video. <laughs> yeah, this, the and the other one too with the sister. We should actually do that though. Or or the many the many episodes. Oh yeah, you know, with that the... one where it's just Tiny Simon with his wiener hanging out. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> By the time we review Gurren Lagann, I hope there's a live-action Gurren Lagann, and we can review that instead, because then we can talk about how Gurren Lagann is amazing, but the live-action was terrible. We should do a live-action review about Fullmetal Alchemist when it comes out. Oh, yeah, so one of the reasons the 3D animation for the dragons was so good is because all of the trailers for the game are CG uh, 3D animated. Oh, so they had already good, good so, people like, working on it. In all of the trailers are just dragons. The, the trailer is just like a glamour shot of a dragon just like breathing fire. Dagrins. Mm. So are you guys ready for the announcements? Mm-hmm. We have announcements? So, uh, next week we are going to be watching the, the anime movie Your Name. We're going to be talking about that. I'm um, ready to cry. It, it will be our last oh, anime analytics for 2017. I hope you guys will join us. Maybe we'll do a giveaway. That, that'd that be pretty cool. Because you guys are such loyal viewers. And I w- we want to be able to give something back to you guys. So be sure to join us next week for your name. Next month for Manga Monthly Anime on Paper. What if you could read anime? We're going to be <laughs> reading. Are you ready? Are you guys ready? You guys ready? What we're gonna be reading? Hope, Are you guys ready? Wait, 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 wait. Are you guys ready? What? You guys ready? 
Oh my god. Yes! You ready? I'm ready. I'm it's ready. a Kunohana! We have never seen a Kunohana! Oh <laughs> uh, no. I'm so happy! Can we read all of it? I, it I should just be like, read all six volumes. <sighs> we'll keep you wait. guys updated on a. Um... Wait, wait, it's only six volumes? Yeah, it's yeah. only six volumes. Yeah, I can we'll do keep that you guys like three updated hours. on the club board and the Discord. If you guys not have yet joined the Discord, there's a link down at the bottom below where you guys can um join and get all of our updates and talk to us about with some weeby shit. But um we'll tell you what chapters we're gonna be reading to there. I think we're probably gonna go right before the time skip. I was gonna say it's either gonna be the, the festival or all of it, because there's no other good place to stop. Yeah. <laughs> You can't just stop right in the middle. But um, Okunohana, uh, the close, the close in running to it was prison school. Goddamn, that wasn't. You know, that you know, even... <laughs> you know, you know whose vote made Akunohana uh, win? What? Who? Mine. Who? What You're was? What was third? Second, was... second doesn't count. What was third? It was a three-way <laughs> tie for third. Yeah, it, oh, was, it was it was two votes for prison school, two votes for Okunohana, and that was and actually kind of an even spread of the votes. Actually, I don't think we've ever had one where like something didn't get zero votes. I yeah, actually right. didn't have a voting for this anime or this manga because I I didn't know I don't read manga, so I literally just don't feel right putting in my own. Well, I don't read it. I still put in. No, so... sometimes. Next month, that will be January, January nineteenth, two thousand eighteen. Wow. Wait, probably, shit, I'll time goes by. I'm so far away. Yeah. yeah. What about? Wait, what? What about That'll January fifth be... and January twelfth? Ah, uh, those anime are animes. Anime ones, yeah. Never mind. <laughs> those are anime ones. So it'll be January nineteenth, two thousand, two thousand eighteen. Uh, we'll be talking about Akunohana. We'll keep the chapters updated. Uh, we have a Discord down below if you guys want to help join our Discord and help support the Otakus Anonymous. Next week is going to be we're discussing the anime Your Name, and we'll be doing a giveaway. And anything else anyone wants to mention? I love you. I love you. I, I love, love you too. I love you too. Shout out to Echo. Echo. I, I'm so sorry. I'm gonna spell your name with. There we go. <laughs> I promise I'll spell it right. That's Echo if you guys want to see him stream. I'm uh, gonna stream Monster Hunter after this. Oh, is it, is it beta again? Is the beta open again? Be be beta time, yeah. I'm gonna be playing oh. up a tree. That's silver. And... I need to get it. I need to go get it. I need to toot my horn. We're all probably just gonna be sitting in Echo stream just like oogling about Monster Hunter. I'm gonna uh, be streaming Shadow of the Colossus. Actually. Oh, you're gonna stream Shadow of the Colossus? All right. Yeah, then. right after this. And I'm gonna be working on bags, so I'm not streaming today. Go ahead, guys, <laughs> and show the show our streamers some love because they work hard to watch anime every week and talk about it. Thanks for watching anime, some, guys. Sometimes it is really hard to watch the anime. It is. Thanks yeah, for doing it, the it thing is, that you would really do hard. anyway, even if we didn't tell you to. Mm. Some of the animes we've watched, I wouldn't have watched, even if. Yeah. Like Edo Manga I, I would not have watched Edo Manga Sensei. <laughs> I'm really glad we movie. made Echo watch. Thank you guys for voting for Edo Manga Sensei and making Echo watch. No, 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 no. I, no one voted. There was no vote. I chose it. Oh, thank <laughs> you I wanted you everyone to it. watch it. Thank you, Diggy, for sitting, everyone. I love it. I love making everyone to trash. Because I'm trash and everyone needs to know how I feel. Oh, I forgot to wait. Uh, the oh, ahead, the, ahead, the, the made up the made up Germanic language written language was awesome. <laughs> oh, I don't know yeah, if I was the yeah, only yeah. one who could read it. I don't know if I was the only one who could read it, but the written language in the anime was awesome. You can kind of translate it. I can read it because it's from the game. So like it because it's it's there's an actual name for it. And it's like a, a fucked up mixture of like French, Italian, and uh, German. I, I mean, I can I could just read it. Yeah. So I, that's why I said it was pseudo Germanic, because the written language was like it, it was.
kind of Germanish words, but the actual <clears throat> written language was letters that were completely made up. But for some reason, as soon as I saw it, I could read it, and I was like, "Huh, that's awesome." <laughs> yeah, it's it. It was supposed to be like a lingua franca, so that like if you knew any European language, you would be able to understand it. Oh, well, yeah, but the actual letters, the actual letters, oh, were just no, I know you said up. this already. You're, you're repeating yourself. He's too excited. I, un Echo, just I understand. Excited. I totally like a, one. One of the screenshots just went by, and the the letters were in it. I was like, oh yeah, I forgot. I wanted to mention that. It was good. You okay, I'm done. Five. Thank you, everyone, so much for watching. Hope you guys enjoyed this week's anime <laughs> analytics. And uh, go ahead and show our streamers some love. Echo's gonna be playing. Monster one time. Monster Hunter Beta, that's what it is. Echo's going to be playing Monster Hunter Beta. And I will be and playing Shadow And happy Shadow holidays, Colossus. everyone. And happy holidays. Oh, yeah. I hope you guys holidays. have a good yeah. Christmas. Talk about your Christmas experiences before and after. Tell us what you guys wish for, and we'll see. Hopefully you'll get it. What were you thinking before you went into this holiday season? And now that it is the holiday season, what are you thinking now? Yeah. How would you rate this holiday season? How would you rate this holiday season? Afros. season? <laughs> what, what, what do you think about the uh, holiday season character designs? Yeah, my what favorite think... is Elf on the Shelf. What do you? Oh my god! <laughs> <laughs> I'm more a fan of Origin Santa. His redesign, I'm not a fan. My sister does Elf on the Shelf for uh, my niece. It, it, it's so cute. But one time, <laughs> she did something in the bathroom with toothpaste and stuff. So I went. I got up that morning. I opened the door. And I turn on the light, and in my face was that, and I screamed so loud. <laughs> it was like, whoa! Like, it was like, oh my god, it was scary. It scared the fuck out of me. My second I favorite character my pants. is Krampus. <laughs> I, I really oh enjoyed god. the Christmas wrappings. I gotta go. Thank you, everyone. <laughs> the, 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 pressy, the pressy papers? Yeah. Yeah. Uh... Goodbye, everyone. Thank you for watching. Bye. 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 Bye.